Hey, this is Kat from Red Mountain Shaman, and I share shamanic wisdom through dreams, visions, nature, synchronicities, intuition, channeling, art, music, photography, and shamanic journeys. Welcome back to my channel. In today's episode, I'm going to be sharing a message I channeled from Archangel Metatron on October 22nd, 2022. At the end of this message, I'll be sharing a bit of a commentary. Enjoy. Good afternoon, beloveds. As the chaos on your planet ramps up, be prepared for the falling away of falsehoods. This revealing or uncovering will continue so that humanity can begin to see with clear eyes once again. Many things have been hidden from your view. Many things have been inverted, twisted, and manipulated. This has been a game of fools, but this game is soon coming to an end, as great beacons of light stream in from many sources, both off-world and within your planetary ranks. There will be those who are not ready to accept truth or accept the idea that they have been deceived, and this is okay. The turning of the wheel cannot be stopped. You will see the pendulum begin to swing as truth is revealed. A new cycle is coming. A rebirth is on the way. Be at peace. Hold steadfast. A purging is imminent. Purify yourselves and know you are loved with the perfect love of the Creator. Let your spirits rise with the rising of the planetary energy at this time, this momentous time. Those who have ears to hear will hear this message and understand. Let that which is not in resonance with your rising spirit fall away. Move into love, move into unity. All is being purified at this time, so do not fear the loss of that which is not serving you. There are better ways to live and better ways to function as a society. The universe will assist you in opening the door to these better ways, even though it may seem insurmountable. The Great Spirit sees all and knows exactly what it is doing. Be as the eagle, high and free. The Spirit of the Eagle is with you, and the Great Nation of the Eagle will usher in its signature energy that is freedom. For freedom is the greatest gift of the sovereign soul. It is the way through to the golden dawn. And what is this golden dawn, you ask? This is the new morning of the new soul. The true order of the cross in which the body, mind, and soul come into balance with the great spirit. Those who are ready will experience the wonders of the true golden dawn or golden age, for it is rising within you. Allow the golden light to flow through you and feel yourself shifting and your consciousness rising. For in the turning of the tide is the face of the new dawn, a rising of a morning star, brighter than has ever before been seen. Behold this new dawn, brighter than the noonday sun. Thank you, Metatron. So I found two scriptures that seem to relate to this channeling. One is Revelations 22.5, and it says, And there shall be no night there, and they need no candle, neither light of the sun, for the Lord God giveth them light, and they shall reign forever and ever. The second one I found was Luke 1. 78 and 79 because of the tender mercy of our God by which the rising sun will come to us from heaven to shine on those living in darkness and in the shadow of death to give our feet unto the path of peace and then the last thing I found was the full card because he mentions that this has been a game of fools I thought that was a really interesting uh, turn of words and I was guided to look up the full card in the tarot deck and the full card represents new beginnings, having faith in the future, being inexperienced, not knowing what to expect, beginner's luck, improvisation, trusting in the universe. 
And then the meaning of fool in the dictionary is to trick, dupe, or deceive someone. So it's almost like we've been in this game where we've all had the wool pull, pulled over our eyes. And now it's time to have the veil lifted and begin to see with new eyes. So until next time, please press like, subscribe, and the notification bell if you'd like to be notified of my next video.